Hey, what is going on everybody? It's Youngs. Today, I'll be showing you guys the Binary Dawn shotgun. This is the unique shotgun from the Trials of Osiris. I got this from the Gold Tier Package. That is the bounty where you have to complete 10 Trials matches and kill 75 Guardians as a fire team. Anyway guys, the first thing I want to do is compare this with the Matador and a Silence of AR. And if you guys don't know what the Matador is, it is basically the best possible Crucible shotgun. It was this and the Felwinters were the most used shotguns in the game uh, for the House of Wolves and before the Taken King came out. And some people still use these weapons because they're that good. Anyway, let's take a look. Now you can see the Matador has less rate of fire, less stability, less reload, but that impact and range really does make that difference. That is what the Matador and the Felwinters are known for, that impact and range. Absolutely beastly shotguns. Let's take a look at the Aarn. Now we got same rate of fire, same impact, a little less range, less stability, less reload, and more in the mag for the AR. Not bad. So let's take a look here. Now the, all these shotguns do come with solar damage. These can drop anywhere from 300 to 310 from the gold tier package. And I got mine at 303. Uh, not, not too crazy about that. Now we got some basic sights here. None of them increase your range or impact, so I am not interested. Now we got range finder aiming this weapon increases effective range that's not a bad perk at all for a shotgun i will take that all these shotguns do come with range finder and the same middle perks now here we got flared magwell reload this weapon even faster brace frame increased stability reduce mag and field scout um i actually would go with field scout here just because i could carry more ammo and flared magwell would probably be my next choice I'm not too crazy about increased stability for a shotgun and it doesn't have full auto or anything so I'm not too worried about brace frame so it's whatever you guys prefer but I'll go with field scout now I got army of one here these last perks can change it will be different for everybody I got army of one quick unassisted kills with this weapon reduce grenade and melee cooldown now the shotgun can come with three other perks being life support exhumed close and or personal life support will when you get kills when you're critically wounded you have a chance to regen your health exhumed is when you get revived then you have increased range and handling for a short period of time and close and personal is when you get a kill and then you get a short period of time of 25 percent bonus damage with a melee anyway guys let's take a look at the aesthetics looks very nice as I said before, I do like the colors a lot for the trials, and I like their little emblem, the little sun here. Very cool. You can see the eye in the back. Pretty cool, and I love how this stock looks. It's very unique compared to any other shotgun in the game. Anyway, guys, I do have some gameplay. Let's take a look. Now, I am certainly not a shotgun connoisseur at this game. I prefer to use a sniper, and I will switch off to a fusion rifle every once in a while. I don't know. I kind of feel dirty using a shotgun. I don't know, guys. That's just me. But anyway, I did manage to get a few clips for you guys. I did take this to PvP, of course. It's a trials weapon, and I will go over what I ran. I was using my Titan for the majority of this, but I did use Blink, as you can see right there. I was a hunter for some of these clips, and Blink shotgun is just dirty as fuck, guys. It's so dirty. But anyway, mo the majority of these clips, I was my Titan, and I actually was using Defender subclass with um, the no backup plans. For my force barrier and it actually works very well if you guys are titans and you like shotguns defender class isn't a bad idea with no backup plans it's not bad at all guys the way that no backup plans work is that when you get a shotgun kill when your melee is fully regened and recharged you will get that overshield you will get force barrier it works very nice with shotguns anyway you can see in this video i get a lot of sliding shotgun kills you can call me a noob you can call me a scrub i don't know guys that's just what comes natural to me i'm just not used to using shotguns in this game i really don't use them but anyway i didn't want to make this video too long for you guys but thank you so much for watching please leave a like on the video if you enjoyed the video and suffer the support i'd highly appreciate it